Friday night footy back in Sydney suburbs. Leichhardt Oval, one of the great rugby league grounds. With Keith Galloway injured, Aaron Woods was left to carry a decimated Tigers pack. With the ink barely dry on Robbie Farah's four-year deal. And there's Farah combining with Marshall. Marshall's into the backfield. The captain led the Tigers into attacking territory. It's a half volley take by Marshall. Lawrence will score. Chris Lawrence, the centre, has scored. Sustained attack by the Tigers. They went there once, twice, thrice. And they came back with four. Receiving a penalty for a dangerous tackle, the Tigers took to two. There were more points on offer after Jared Hayne dropped his lollies. Parramatta scrambling to keep them at bay. And Farrah to Lawrence looking for two. He's got two. Chris Lawrence has scored again. Chris Sando steamrolled twice by Chris Lawrence in the opening 20 minutes. Parramatta buckling under the Tigers' weight of possession. And here goes Aceford, the other centre. He's gone over now. They hunt as a double. They combine beautifully. Matthew Ryan and Marika Korobiti exchange pleasantries. Hello, Ryan decides that something happened there that he didn't like. The minor misdemeanor ignited Jared Hayne. And there's a bust, Hayne down the side, gets the ball away to Tautai. Tautai's inside the 40, he's inside the 30, supporters coming. He gets it to Jacob Loco and Loco has the ball dislodged. How are you feeling after the chase? Yeah, it's tough that one, but... um. You know, to hold him in the middle in that first half. A good effort, so um, Blue and do the same in the second. Robbie Farrar leading the Tigers to an 18-0 half-time lead. After two scoreless halves of footy, the Eels finally crossed the line. And Hayden stayed alive on the blind side. Ryan Dutton the Morgan. Morgan goes in to score. Showing and going, Sando put the foot down. Then a dummy to Ryan and he goes skirting out wide and then he straightens. Sando's inside 30. He grubbers them for his winger. Blair's in a race for cover beating. Swinging momentum, Benji hit top gear. And here we got the tap. Marshall has taken a quick tap and bolted. There's nobody at home. Marshall scores a 70 metre try after he took a quick tap penalty. Harris pain exacerbated by a brain explosion. Here's Marshall dribbling it in and then batted. And oh, hang on a moment, they got, oh, did he put a hand on it with downward pressure? Tim Molson. Tim Molson. Wow. So that's all right, he's not out. It goes through Jared Haynes' legs. That's a try. And there's downward pressure. I've seen things tonight, Ray, that I haven't seen in a long, long time. <laughs> Corabiti succumbed to an ankle injury as the Eels salvaged a late try. It's come from Roberts and gone quickly along the back line. There's a chance in the corner for Tautai. He went in and away. He got the ball over the line. I think it's a try. I think it's a try. With 10 to go, Para weren't done yet. And here is all good, breaking into the back play. Keating's looking for support. Here comes Hayes. Floats the ball. Loco will score. Don't tell me we're seeing a repeat of last year's game. Jacob Miller put the boot into the Eels' comeback. The Tigers with a 31 points to 18 victory. Liam Cox, NRL.com.